Hey guys, Prodigy here, and today I'm gonna be making a Knights and Dragons video, and I don't know why, but I feel like playing Knights and Dragons more often now. Maybe it's because of the new epic bosses and how they look, and this one looks pretty awesome, and I'm gonna get this armor to... I'm probably gonna get the plus version, and I'll make a video on that too, of beating it the 43rd time. And then I'm going to switch it out for mm, the Fire Earth Epic Boss. It's pretty old, the one I have right now. I'm going to switch it out for that one, though. She's one guy. See how it goes. So... After this, I'm obviously going to craft it, and if I don't have enough space, I won't bore you by just, like, fusing. I'll craft it on my own, because it's not that much of a big deal, just me crafting. And this is Fire Earth, so yeah, that's why I really want it. And its name is Lilith, and there's a reason I like that name, like... There's a reason I like that name on this epic boss. Not just because of the epic boss, but more of the name. So, yeah. Okay, I'm going to craft it on my own then. And I'm I'm probably going to be making more Knights and Dragons videos now, not just Epic Boss, probably something else too. But that'll be later on, maybe just Epic Boss and the Fusion Frenzy stuff right now. And I didn't get the last two Epic Bosses, the Earth and the Spirit, and Mono would be amazing, but I didn't have enough time. Actually, I had enough time, but I didn't I wasn't really into Knights and Dragons that time. So I'm probably going to get it later and just go to Arena. Yeah, this is the epic boss I missed. This purple one in the background. Cyclops, I think. And a green wolf thing. Um, I won't do Arena right now, and I think that's going to be the end of this video. I'll make another video of me defeating the epic boss on the 43rd level. And yeah, 